Hello, wildlings. I'm your creep smith, and you found my fear forge. <laughs> Lucky you. Tonight's tale, The Devil's Footprints. The Devil's Footprints is a historical, unsolved mystery centering around a set of strange tracks that appeared in the newly fallen snow in Devon, England, in 1855. It was the 9th of February when the Devil's Footprints first appeared. The townspeople in County Devon, England, woke up that morning to find thousands of mysterious tracks in the snow. They resembled footprints left by cloven hooves, and they extended throughout an area that covered several towns. The mysterious footprints were found to go up the side of walls, down into gardens, onto roofs, up and down the sides of fences where it was impossible for any person or animal to step. Some of the tracks just came to a stop in the middle of nowhere as if their owners had suddenly vanished. Some stopped abruptly and continued after a large break. Others stopped at high walls only to continue on the other side, leaving the snow on top of the wall completely untouched. One set of footprints even went across the river, continuing on to the other side as if whoever or whatever had left them had passed straight across the water. A feeling of deep unease spread through the people who lived in the area, and many believed that the footprints could only have been made by the devil himself. There were also rumors about sightings of a devil-like figure in the Devon area during the scare. Many townspeople armed themselves and attempted to track down the beast responsible, but without success. There were those who refused to believe that the footprints had been made by the devil. They came up with their own theories. Some said that the townspeople might have been nuts and imagined the whole thing. Others thought that the tracks could have been left by hopping mice. Some theorized that a balloon might have floated across the landscape trailing a rope, making odd tracks in the snow on its way. Yet more people said it could have been caused by kangaroos, who escaped from the zoo. Although the footprints looked nothing like the tracks a kangaroo would leave. Do you really think that any of these theories are likely? Perhaps it is easier to believe in unlikely explanations rather than accept that the devil visited Devon on one cold winter's night and stalked through the town looking for sinners to drag to hell. Today, the devil's footprints remain an unsolved mystery, and the strange phenomenon is still unexplained. Well... I'm a deeply cynical old bastard, and I'm of the belief that hoaxers gonna hoax. But you make your own decisions, kids. This one, uh, well, it's a mystery for a reason. Stay scary, my wildlings, and make the most of your nights. <laughs>